Meghan Markle, the Duchess of Sussex, has been told to soothe the challenging relationship and turn it into something amazing it has been claimed. Meghan celebrated her 38th birthday earlier this month on August 4, which makes her a Leo according to the Zodiac calendar. According to celebrity astrologer Mystic Meg, Meghan and other Leos need to soothe challenging relationships. For Leo's horoscope she wrote in the sun, the connection between Neptune and the moon helps you to understand what others think, and why. Then you can soothe challenging relationships and turn good love into something amazing. Though the family may be celebrating a cash win, you get more secret satisfaction from extra money you work for. After months of rumors hounding Meghan about her relationship with sister-in-law Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge, her horoscope could be a sign that Meghan needs to smooth over their relationship. Meghan and Kate have put on a united front in recent months. Both duchesses were spotted enjoying the tennis at Wimbledon in July where they smiled and chatted easily. Meghan and Kate were then later seen with their husbands, Prince Harry and Prince William, at the polo with their children. However, one royal expert has revealed that behind the scenes the rift has been settled. Speaking to Hello! magazine, a source said, Kate was a great source of support to Meghan in the days leading up to Archie's birth and, despite reports of the rift, they are family and have a really lovely friendship. Their relationship has certainly evolved over time and they have become closer since Meghan's wedding. Reportedly, since the birth of Meghan's son Archie Harrison the relationship between the two duchesses has flourished. The source said, they talk and text regularly, they have more in common, and Kate has wanted to make sure Meghan has felt welcome into the family. However, tensions reached fever pitch when Meghan and Harry moved out of Kensington Palace into their own home in Windsor. Meghan Markle, Duchess of Sussex, may decide to feign a headache to avoid taking part in blood sports when she visits Balmoral next week, according to royal experts. This will be the first time Meghan has stayed at Balmoral, and shows the Queen's favor towards the new Duchess. Archie Mountbatten Windsor, Meghan and Harry's son who was born earlier this year, is also expected to make the trip. However according to experts speaking to the son the Duchess may feign a headache as an excuse to avoid blood sports. Members of the royal family frequently go hunting whilst at Balmoral, with both grouse and deer having been targeted in the past. However according to the Daily Mail grouse hunting has been cancelled this year, as a plague of heather beetles has reduced the number of birds. They also like to go fishing in the River Dee, a top spot for salmon fishing. However there is speculation that Meghan, who eats a vegan diet during the week, may not wish to participate. Meghan is well known for her love of animals. She is patron of animal welfare charity Mayhew, which helps pet owners who fall on hard times. Talking about the charity's work she said, as a proud dog rescue owner, I know from personal experience the joy that adopting an animal into your home can bring. The role that we, as people, play in rehoming and rescuing these animals is vital, but the role of organizations such as Mayhew is unparalleled. As a patron of Mayhew, I encourage you to get involved in whatever way you can, through pet adoption, volunteering, donation or spreading the word. We are interconnected and through these animals we find an even greater link to community and the part we play. Meghan and Harry married in May 2018 at St. George's Chapel in Windsor Castle. A year later their son, currently the seventh in line to the throne, was born.